Hey guys, this is the Ultimate Warrior here, and I have some news, but I'm not the first one to it. But um, I actually heard this from Back Pocket Game Reviews. You should definitely check out his channel if you haven't already. But yeah, I heard and saw and confirmed that um, L.A. Noir is apparently getting a remaster, a remastered version for. Uh, Xbox One, PlayStation 4, and the Nintendo Switch, and I think it might be coming out to a PC as well. I can't quite remember. Maybe Steam, but yeah. I, but it's coming out to PS4, which is what I have. I probably would get it on the Switch if I had one, but check out my previous video of why I don't have the Switch yet. Um... So I'm on GameStop's website right now, and so I'm just kind of looking at um, the product details. So this includes the uh, complete original game and all downloadable content, plus new collectibles and detective suits to unlock with each with unique special abilities. I didn't know that detective suits had special abilities, but um, more on that in a minute. It features an array of technical and graphical enhancements for a more realistic Los Angeles. So, yeah, um, oddly enough, I'm one of those individuals that have never played L.A. Noir. Now, I was excited for it when it came out. I think it was on, it came out on PS3 and I wanted it there, but, you know, being like a broke college student, which I think I was a college student at the time, either a college student or I was like towards the end of uh, graduating or like it was in my senior year, I can't quite remember. But I, I was a, a broke person then and things really haven't changed since then, but I didn't have a job so I was trying to really watch my GameStop store credit and what I purchased you know, try to make decisions, you know, based upon, you know, what games took priority, I believe. I don't know, it's been so long, but all I know is that I didn't have the funds for L.A. Noir at the time, although I did want to play it. It seemed pretty interesting, and it kind of uh, reminded me about, uh, what's that game, Heavy Rain. So, I, I was in the Heavy Rain at the time, and after L.A. Noir came out, I became interested in that. But, so yeah, I was a little bit sad, so I just kind of tried to talk myself out of it. Just try to look up, like, the mediocre reviews. Like, it wasn't as good, or, like, the driving's unrealistic, or there's too much driving. I'm like, oh, too much driving, don't feel like it. <laughs> so yeah. But, you know, fast forward to now, and I hear this preview, or information. So... I think I'm going to pick it up, and I will look forward to live streaming it. But the problem is, unless one of these games get delayed, is that this comes out on the 14th of November 2017. You want to know what else comes out on the 14th of no November or 2017? Uh, that would be, if I'm not mistaken... Uh, the Sims 4 Deluxe Edition, and I'm going to just look that up real quick just to make sure. So yeah, um, L.A. Noir, the remastered version, comes out on uh, the 17th of November. N not the 17th, the 14th of November. I'm getting, getting it all mixed up in my mind. And yes, I'm looking at it right now. The Sims 4 Deluxe Party Edition, that comes out on the same date. You know, I could wait and get the regular version, but, and that comes out like three days later. But I really want the, the Sims 4 game as soon as possible. So, yeah, I, my dilemma is because I got Sims 4 pre-ordered at GameStop. So, my dilemma is do I pre-order L.A. Noir at GameStop just so I can go ahead and get both games and get in and get out and at least have them or do I wait 
and actually uh, pre-order L.A. Noir online on Best Buy's website, assuming that at that point I actually have the Gamers Club unlocked and can get that. And it might come a little bit later, perhaps. I'm not quite sure how their program works. It might come a little bit later, but I won't have it. You know, part of me is just like, go ahead and just buy that GameStop that, was, that way. It's in your hands and you can do a haul on it. But the other part of me is like, no, you were broke then, you're broke now. Save that extra six or eight bucks, whatever it is, having the 20% off. And just go ahead and wait because you're not going to be playing L.A. Noir anyway when that comes out. Because it is it's sadly true, I'll be playing the, the Sims Deluxe Party Edition first. If I even play it on the same day because I feel like I'm going to be dog tired from work. So, that's just my uh, little dilemma. If if you have any suggestions on where I should get this game from, you know, between uh, GameStop going in physically and getting it or getting it online Best Buy and risk getting it a few days afterwards. Uh, just let me know what you think because I'm curious to hear. To my knowledge, there isn't any, there aren't any DLCs uh, that you get for pre-ordering it either. But you know, that's all. That all could change. So, like at this point, I feel like I kind of just want to save myself the hassle and get it from GameStop. But I don't know if I get it from Best Buy, that can go ahead and help pay off the thirty dollars. For the year that it would be worth. But I don't know. Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And if you happen to like this video. Or you're a fan of this video games. Or even Ultimate Games in general. Or even a fan of drink testing. Taste testing. Toys. Reviews. Stuff like that. Discussions. Then feel free to check out the rest of my channel. And if you happen to like what you see. Then please leave a like. Comment. Share. Subscribe. Do what you gotta do, and I will see you guys in the next video. Alright guys, talk to you later. Bye.